Self-analysis may disclose weakness. That a person doesn't like to acknowledge. Hi Jordan, hi. Uh, thank you for joining me on our second session. If you remember from last week, we said that the unsophisticated waking judgment of someone who has just woken up from a dream uh, assumes that his dreams, even if they did not themselves come from another world, had at all events carried him off into another world. Just think about it like a moving picture. When you're watching it, you're carried away into a different world, a world profoundly imagined by the director where you're constantly trying to make meaning of the symbolism that appears on the screen. Jordan, I can't help you if you don't open up to me. It's already been 45 minutes since you've been asleep. You have to understand that the only person you can truly lie to is yourself. So open up and tell me what's been troubling you. It doesn't matter. It's nothing, it was just a dream. It's nothing. It's just a dream. It's just a dream. I'd have to pay Thank you. 
is a royal road, the unconscious mind. It is one of the several ways you can have a deep conversation with your inner self. Sometimes, in the case of children's dreams of sweets and toys, the wish is portrayed directly in the content of the dream. The motivations underlying the dreams of adults are often more likely to be unconscious, often originating in repressed experiences of childhood. Originating in the repressed experiences of childhood? Really? It all makes sense. Doc, I want to be a freak. That's good, my son. Keep working on it and you'll get there. You. You were who I wanted to become. You were my witch. And who's the other guy? Who's the other me that I never wanted? Is all I can do is all.